everyone, this is Mitch with One Monroe, and today we're talking about hand wills. Folks, hand wills have been the way that human beings interact and make machines work since the very first machine was made. When the wheel started rolling things around, it also enabled man to operate machinery. So when I refer to the hand wheel as man's interaction with machine, that's truly what it is. And as such, it's been in production for a long time. Virtually every need for a hand wheel has been met over time. And like many other products that Monroe represents, they have become a commodity. That means that there are many standard designs made in high production, low cost facilities that can be modified at the point of sale for a particular use. Hand wheels are made of plastic, they're made of aluminum, they're made of mild steel, they're made of stainless steel, even cast iron for ease of production when weight is not a consideration. So the hand wheel has become a part of human life every day and the materials that they are made of are the standard materials that manufactured items are made of world round. Hand wheel designs vary in a number of ways. First and foremost would be the diameter of a hand wheel or how big around the hand wheel is from one end to the other in its diameter. The reason diameter matters is the greater the diameter, the more force an individual can exert on the wheel. Remember, hand wheels are operated by human beings. Take, for example, this cast iron wheel, which is quite heavy. It's used to open and close valves. You can see that there are finger grips for you to be able to grasp it firmly and operate the wheel. Each and every wheel has a unique purpose for its design. This dished wheel has no spokes. Note that this dished wheel has spokes. Why would one be different than the other? In a manufacturing environment where this wheel may be spinning quickly, you might want to avoid the ability of putting your fingers inside the wheel while it's moving and becoming injured. So each and every particular wheel has a particular reason for the way that it's designed. Be they dished, spoked, tri-spoked, solid, they're all designed differently for a reason. And now we're gonna talk about handles. The idea of the hand wheel is basically pretty simple. The human being takes the wheel, spins it with their hands. In some cases, like heavy duty hand wheels, there's actually finger grips built into the hand wheel. But sometimes this is not enough force to make the work go. And that's when a handle is installed on the hand wheel. And there are two basic styles. First and most commonly used is the fold away handle. There's a couple of reasons why you want that handle to fold away. In a lot of machines, the wheel spins independent of human control while it's doing the work. And if that's the case, you certainly don't want this big handle spinning around in space where you can hit it with your knuckles, your hands, or any number of things that make it unsafe. So the handle folds out of the way, but when you need it to exert extra force, it's there and it greatly increases both the speed with which you can turn the wheel and the force that you can exert on the wheel. Now, the first handles that went on hand wheels were fixed. They simply screw onto the hand wheel just like this on this cast iron hand wheel. And when tightened into place, allow you to exert that much greater force. So the handle adds a great degree of flexibility in terms of your ability to move the wheel quickly and to move the wheel with greater force. So two styles, fixed and fold away. And another note about safety. In some cases, you may want to be able to stop a wheel from turning independently of the work. And in that case, we make wheels with a safety clutch in the hub that allows you to make the wheel be independent of the work performed. They don't use them very often, but in some situations, it's the safest type of wheel to use. And of course, they're available at One Monroe. Call One Monroe today and let us help you solve your hand wheel challenge.